some people think our day starts when we show up for eight o'clock for a training to start but uh, actually it starts usually a day or two before because we have to be able to get everything packed up and ready even if we're flying or hoteling and those kinds of things which actually probably takes a little bit more planning time we have to get everything ready to go so uh, loading up getting everything set up for the RV and uh, mapping out our plans and direction and today we're we're going down to Leesburg Georgia we have to be there prior to four o'clock uh, to be able to uh, get into the gate for tomorrow's class and so we uh, we got to head out probably by about 10 o'clock today it's about uh, four and a half hours something like that from Rome to Leesburg stop to get fuel all those kinds of things so Got to get the saws ready to go. Time to do a little reduced downtime maintenance here. Little clean up compressed air won't hurt. doesn't take a whole lot of time to go down through and clean things up. But. Chain looks like it's in pretty good shape still. Got that ready to go. Get the saws back in the compartment. That'll be ready. I think I've got to check bar oil and uh, gas mix. I think we've got our our true fuel already packed. We'll take a look at that. Got to load the Jeep on the trailer for this trip. Gonna need it in making Thursday and Friday. Crank up the M2 here. Gotta move it back a little bit, match up the trailer.
hot weather makes sure we got the tires and things in good shape. Oh, yeah. Everything's working. Check all the compartments. I take the truck out, so uh, the RV, to pack up the power cord, make sure we got everything set inside. Laura takes care of most of that. Good bit of rain here yesterday, about a almost inch and inch and a half looks like. <laughs> That's good. That means the grass will be growing like crazy when we get back home by Friday. So we've got to take the Jeep, so got to get it cranked up and loaded on the trailer. All right, this is the four wheeling process here. We got to get it back down in the four wheel drive to get up this slick thing. Jeep does pretty good. Perfect. All right, I'll get her strapped down. These things are have to go, go through the wheels. Get that back in the airlock. Yeah, we we call it the duck. This thing was on there when we got it from, I think, a movie. Check some oil in here. Oh, yeah. Looks good. Still got another about 10,000 miles to go before the service. So that'll be another $700 or so. So we drive out today, it's Monday. Tuesday, we're in Leesburg, Georgia. Then we have Wednesday, we're gonna be in Hamilton, Georgia. And then we have Macon. I think they're with the city and also some county. The Thursday will be a demonstration day. And uh, Friday will actually be a hands-on day too with that particular group in Macon. Get back home probably late Friday night and uh, start getting ready for, for next week. <laughs> 